My name is Jason T. Ingram. I am the artist known as Fake Zappa. I do multimedia work. I'm an equal opportunity offender. So if you're on the liberal side or the conservative side, chances are I will come up with something that might challenge you beyond what you were able. So that's my uh, spoiler alert and disclaimer and warning. And I like to do everything from comedy to activism, especially when it comes to what I consider to be harmful mental health practices. The name Fake Zappa came to me in 2017 when I was trying to come up with a name for my solo art. I'd been running a band for a couple of years at that time, and I was wanting to branch out and do some more of my own work. And so I thought, you know, as somebody who's being open about my mental illness and living with debilitating disorders, it would be natural to start pretending to be somebody else. And I seem to have a kindred spirit towards Frank Zappa, his philosophy, his business model, and a lot of his work that he did. So I started dressing up like kind of like the way he did in the 60s, and I'm continuing my work, and I started a business, and I'm continuing to do stuff here in uh, what I call the above-ground man cave, which suffered a devastating fire in, in 2018, and I've been uh, recovering and sort of restoring my life and, and getting back and uh, trying to get the exposure that I feel like I deserve based on what I have to contribute to the world of arts and entertainment. So I thank you for coming to my channel, and I always appreciate comments. You can go to fakezappa.com or sundaydriverproductions.com, and also make sure to check out my band. It's called Dialectic Flowers, and it's ambient progressive rock, and we do alternative meditation, music, techno, ambient, and all kinds of what we call mellow mayhem. So thank you for your time. I really appreciate it.